Todd brings us our next quick tip and saves us from descending into Spinal Tap references, which we could do just for hours. Uh, I ditched my bedside alarm clock about a year ago in favor of using my Series 5 Apple Watch in nightstand mode. As you mentioned in episode 888, I have two additional tips. Once the watch is in nightstand mode, which is, as I as uh, last week, the watch is on charge on its side, crown facing up. Okay. Uh, tapping or nudging your nightstand, so simply making the watch move without even touching the watch, will turn on the watch display so you can see what time it is. It's much easier than trying to tap the screen in the dark. Totally correct and great tip. Uh, caution, he says, when the alarm is on and you want to snooze. There you will see two labels at the top of the display, one underneath the crown, which is for snooze, and one underneath the button on the watch, which is for stop. However, if you touch those labels, they also will activate. So if you happen to touch the stop label, it will stop your alarm and not snooze it. So uh, just be aware of that. I, I don't I don't even know. I guess I knew that the crown would snooze it because I'm sure I've seen it in my, you know, wake from slumber mode. But um, but I, I don't I don't even remember seeing stop. But, um, but I yeah. So anyway, this is great. That's why we love quick tips is to point out the things that are obvious, but not to all of us. And that's sort of the key. So, it's beautiful. 